What's going on you guys, this is Bring Your Friends and today I'm going to be showing you a tutorial on how to play music through your Ventrilo. Now I've searched on a lot of different guides on YouTube and the one that was most popular was this one had 133,000 views although the way he explained it was very good however the his method was kinda of flawed in my opinion because his setup was basically cramming everything into one line which is the one that you talk through which I actually did it, I ran through the steps and everything like that, however, uh, there seemed to be a lot of problems for me, so the way I solved the problem is basically, you're going to be having more than one vent open, and you're going to be using one name as a music box and the other one as yourself, and basically, it's a lot easier for me, and I'll show you how to do it. The first thing you will need is Winamp. Uh, just don't ask questions, you just have to go along with it. It's the only program that I know of that this setup can actually work on Ventrilo. The second program you are going to need is Virtual Audio Cable Control Panel. Now, pretty much once you run it and install it, um, you are going to have to have two channels set. So pretty much just hit two and just hit set. And then once it is there, you are going to see, if you go to Volume Control Options, actually, no, not Volume Control, it is playback devices. So once you know that the lines are set, you're going to have two lines on your playback for sound. I'm not I believe I'll try and link you to the actual virtual audio cable. I'm not sure if the links work, but just bear with me. I mean, you know, even though pirating's bad bad enough as it is, but whatever. So, uh, we'll start from scratch. So once you have Winamp, you are going to go to options, preferences and then you're going to go to all the way down to output and then you'll see null soft direct sound output 2.6 you're going to go to configure and then your device is going to be line one put it at line one hit apply hit ok so that's done with so the next thing once you set your lines or whatever to virtual audio cable once you installed in all that good stuff leave everything else alone uh, if you want an example, just use exactly what I have here. I didn't really touch anything except the number of lines that I set. So once you hit exit, and this is already up and running. So basically what this does is enabling you to hear your own music. So basically it's going from line one to your speakers. So it's basically going from Winamp, which is line one, to speakers, which is your ears. So right now I'm playing music but I cannot hear it because you have to have audio repeater on every time you load Winamp if you're running it under line one which I just showed you so if you hit start you will should hear music what? There, hold on I gotta open it back up again so line one speakers four so I just glitched out or whatever so now you hear the music So we're on the right track. So the next thing you're going to need is two vents in order to play your music and talk at the same time. So we will go on and try to do that. But the first thing you need to do is configure your Ventrilo to open more than one application at once. So once you installed Ventrilo, you basically just search for Ven or whatever. And like there's Ventrilo on the top. Right click it, go to properties and you're going to need this in there. So basically this is the the program path for Ventrilo and then after you need to hit minus M. That is going to allow you to have more than one Ventrilo open at one time. So once you do that you can have more than one of course. So now I'm going to open both of these and I'm going to show you how to of course uh, set it up. So of course for for yourself it's set up, just your outbound is your speakers, your input is your mic. And I don't use push to talk, I have a pretty good headset, so I just keep the sensitivity around 13, but that's not what we're really, really concerned with. We're concerned with the music playing. So, you have the setup for that. Your output isn't really important, your input is, just because this is your music box, essentially. You're going to have your sensitivity on one, your input is going to be line one, which is technically Winamp, is the virtual audio cable. 
So basically for Nexus, aka Music Box, you're going to uncheck mute microphone binds and you're going to mute the sound. That way, because since you're obviously going to be in the same channel as everybody else, you don't want to hear both of uh, of the same thing. So you only want you just mute the sound on the on the music box and every and you can just hear everyone else through this. So basically Hey Danimal talk. Say hi. Tell everybody you're the fucking best. That's right, baby. Alright, so I'm muting them and now I'm going to play this the music. And I'm test test it out on Danimal. Danimal! How's it sound? Yeah, it sounds fucking spectacular. That's right. All right. So basically, once you have it at this setup, uh, you're pretty much good to go. And oh, yep. And they're playing video games. So that's pretty much the setup that you need. Um, I don't really know other, any other uh, questions behind it. If you do have any questions, uh, please let me know. This is my setup that I use. And the good thing about this is you don't have you can set yourself and the music at two different levels a lot easier than combining everything into one channel, essentially. And that's pretty much it. So hopefully, if you guys like it, uh, share it with your friends and do whatever you can. Uh, hopefully, this helped you out a lot as far as playing music back in Ventrilo while having the freedom to move around without dragging your music box with you. So uh, this is Jeff. Bring your friends, and I'm out. See you guys.